Hi guys, Lord Savine here, bringing you episode 4 of my Jurassic Park Let's Play. I know it's been a while since I've done this, it's actually been a couple of weeks. But Jurassic Park, at least the way I'm doing it right now, kind of takes a bit of time uh, to, to process through. You have to sit down and really dedicate some playtime to it. Because I'm trying to do one episode per story arc, rather than having, you know, it broken up into a billion different episodes. So... When we last left off, we had gone through, cleared out the raptor pen, ended up at the visitor center. And then now I think... I'm going to do this a little out of order, actually. Normally I go and destroy the uh, raptor nest, but I think the next thing we're going to do is do the, the ship. What's in here, damn it? Let's jump over that and get the egg. Yeah, that's one of the other missions is to collect all the eggs, so you might as well get them while you're here. I think there's one up here, too. These little compies. Ah, there you go. Yeah, usually I will... What's in here, damn it? Um, usually I'll do the raptor nest after the uh, raptor pen, just because, you know, same thing, might as well. I think we'll do it a little differently this time. I guess you can't get over there. I always wondered what that R was for. I know, it, I know it spells out something, like there's little letters all over the island, but I'm not exactly sure what it spells out. I don't know. No idea. If you guys know, let me know in the comments. Uh, let's get up here. That's right. Listen here, you little bastard. These little compies are actually really frustrating. <laughs> let's see trying to remember my way through this little maze area. We can go di diagonally down here. Oh, really? I came down all the way down here just for that? A week. <laughs> oh, well. You can never have too many explosives. So, let's go this way again. And, uh, up, I think. Oh, yeah, that's right. You go up and around. Jeez, it's been a long time since I've played this. That's right, Compy. Fortunately, the Dilophosaur can't spit, uh, spit and hit me while I'm down here. Even though it looks like he should be able to, he can't. Come on. There he goes. No, that's not it. Do you want some of this? I didn't think you wanted any of this. Bring it. And I'll electrocute him. All these Dilophosaurs, man, they make me nervous. Hmm. Now you can get up there. Did I miss it? There we go, got him. Excellent. No, I didn't miss it. You just have to go this way. No, that's not it either. I gotta watch out for the boulders. Make sure they f fall. They're not on top of you, because you'll die. Instantly, actually. There we go. So, ah! I knew that was gonna happen. Damn, the office door. That's right. You want some more of that bowl of snare rifle? Got some more right here. Ah. I like how you jump back about 20 feet. If, uh, you know, like one of those compies hit you, you like fly backwards. Like you've been hit with some sort of projectile weapon. And I, yep. Oh, the raptor popped out right there. So with this, you gotta be very careful about the the rocks and whatnot. So you can easily lose track of where they are. And even the little ones, when they break, those can hurt you too. So here's the secret area. Someone actually mentioned in the comments of a of another video, okay, apparently I went outside, um, that this was here. Uh, I actually, it's kind of a funny story. I was running away from a raptor when I was about mm, six years old, just going, holy crap, I'm gonna die. And I found this area. 
and inside of it when you go through here see like the walls open up and all, there's a D in there I don't know what the D stands for there's an extra life yeah it's just got weapons and an extra life and whatnot it's a little secret area it's pretty cool uh, what's in here nothing yeah and it's really random too so I like that ah. Sneaky bastard. That was the raptor I was running from originally. Alright. Let's see. I want to make sure there's no eggs up here. I know there's one up here somewhere, and you end up having to get them all before you leave the island, so. Let's see. I can switch weapons here. Yeah, the sea, the, whoa, I knew there was a Velocisaur there. Yeah, the sea music is really odd. Hey, egg and a life. Yeah, and I guess that's as far as the island goes. Just cuts off. The sea music's kind of odd. You don't really hear it very often, unless you're literally right here at the end of this map. So... South down here, there's something. I don't remember where. That sounds like Donkey Kong Country music. Hmm. Might as well touch this. Thank you, Muldoon. How's that? How are those raptors going for you? End of the movie, he gets eaten by the... What was it? The, the alpha female? Clever girl. Hmm. Let's see. The... There it is. That's what I'm looking for. And I think that it's right here. Now this is another reason why rockets are awesome. Normally you'd have to, if you had like the shotgun, you'd have to keep blasting that thing in order to get it to to come on over the the gap or whatever. Well, with rockets, you only have to hit it once. That's really sweet. Ah! Don't do it! Oh, no! <laughs> that bastard. He totally hit me off the boat. Weak. Nah, this time I got it, though. I, I thought there was, there was going to be something there, but I was like, no, no, there can't be. Nope, there definitely is. Uh, let's avoid him. There we go. I'm aware. Thank you. Get off the screen. That's the, that's probably one of my biggest complaints about this game, you know, except for not having a save function. That you know they could have made the messages like maybe half the size, having the upper right or upper left part of the screen, just so that you don't. It doesn't, like, blind you to whatever's going on around you. So, in this thing, you have to kill all the dinosaurs on the ship. And then stop it from sailing to the mainland. Because you don't want raptors going through, you know, schoolyards and all that business. 16 dinos. I like how it shortens dinosaurs to dinos. 16 dinos left on the ship. Hmm. Now, in one of these, you have to request level one. I'm trying to remember where you do that. Jesus. Well, there's nothing in here. I wonder what the hell they need these giant chains for. They're all over the place. What the hell are you hanging? Like these giant chains and hooks attached to them. It's like some serial killer set for a movie. It's like Saw 15 in here. Oh, there's the elevator. That'll be where we need to go 
whenever we're done with this level, and then you go down further. I think you actually end up having, like, you get an ID card, and then you have to go to the visitor center. So, it's maybe a two-parter then. Hello, sirs. I see your bullshit. Uh, sure, let's go right. Uh, they keep trying to shove the shotgun down, down my throat. I don't want it. You, sir, can back the hell up. Whoa, 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 chill. Chill, yo. There we go. Hey, there's boxes. Can I stop the raptors with them? I still like how a box that's not even, like, up against the door at all stop the raptors from entering the visitor center. You would think after the... I, I thought there was only, like, eight on the island to begin with. So, well, I guess eight, and then some of them could have bred in the wild. Seven dinos left. Whoa, 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 chill, all of you. Um, yeah, let's go right. Oh, cool. Night vision goggles. I have a feeling I'll be needing those, actually. Come on. Get off the tree. So it's kind of nice to see the little, uh, the color change in the interior here. You know, from that kind of gray rust color to this one. This kind of bright orange. The bad thing is the raptors blend right into it, so sometimes it can be kind of hard to see them. See, so there's three more of these guys. Uh, apparently you're not happy. No, well, now you're dead. Hmm. There's still one more. It's not on the other side of this stuff, so it'll be in this room somewhere. Where, though? Right there. There we go. Excellent. Let's get the rest of the stuff in here, and then go down the elevator to the second level. So there's, I think there's like three levels, maybe four, that you just had to clear out all the dinosaurs. There we go. Alright, I need to go not left, right, and go back to I think it was up here. I may have passed it. Yeah, I think I passed it. Oh, oh, right here. Yeah, so there's the computer. And here's the elevator. Come on. Go in there. Come on. So, yeah, I think you just can go down. And there's level two. Only ten dinosaurs on this level. That'll make things a little easier. Come here, you patrolling raptor. Oh, there's a lot of Dilophosaurs in this room kind of creepy that they just sit there, stare at you, with their head all cocked to the side. It's kind of creepy. Not gonna lie. So, ah, uh, yep. You, sir. Die. No. These damn bushes keep getting in my way as I'm trying to get through doors. Let's save. Officer. Okay, hello. Chill out. You're cool. We're all good here. Uh, yeah, I have these. Hmm. 
There we go. Two more. Holy crap, there's one right there. Alright, let's do that. There we go. Alright, Dr. Wu. Uh, looks like you got owned by the Dilophosaurus, sir. Alright. Well, th I think that's going to be all I can do at this point here. Like, I can go down further in the elevator, but I'm just going to run into a point where I have to have a higher security clearance or something. So, I think I'd better just go to the visitor center right now. I want that. <laughs> I love how it keeps trying to give me shotgun. I don't want to use that. There it is again. There we go. Alright. So, let's run past all this business again. Now that I've done it once, it's, it gets easier. There we go. Back to the vis visitor center. Now there was a section... I think it was on this floor. Switch to rockets. That I couldn't get to before because it said I needed uh, Wu's ID card. Was it down here? No, I think it was upstairs, actually. So, I'm just going to go... Yeah, it was upstairs past Nedry's area. Wasn't down here at all. What was I thinking? Yeah, so I need to go back up where I originally turned on all the motion sensors and all that business. I need to go back up there. There we go. Whoops. Somehow I accidentally clicked off the screen. That was odd. Alright, so... You go in here. There we go. Now one of these is going to be a, a door that I wasn't able to open before. Just a matter of which. This one? Nope. Ah, there we go. Yes, this is it. Okay, so you go here to park control, park security, and your request, request clearance one. Excellent. Jesus, chill. All right, now to get out of here. Now we've got to get clearance level two, security clearance level two, which is in the raptor pen on the bottom floor and like six or seven rooms in, which isn't too far. First, we need to get out of the visitor center to get there. All right, come on. And open. There we go. Excellent. Alright guys, well I'm going to cut it off there. And then we will do part two of this here very soon. So if you like what you saw, please do give it a thumb. Give me some feedback, what you like, what you don't like. I want to hear all about it. And also subscribe if you haven't already. Otherwise, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thanks for watching.